Hi, Jill. I think me and Millie are super happy to be inside today and together as usual. Um, I did work on cue fluency or cue discrimination. That means instead of the dog just guessing and throwing out every trick in their repertoire every time, actually listening and watching your body language uh, and getting the right one. Um, and it is a good way to build relationship and connection. It's good for everyone. And one fun way to do that is to teach the dog to play paper, rock, scissors. But of course we want her to win. So when we do our rock signal, what do we want her to get? Paper, right? We're gonna cover the rock. So when we say rock, we're gonna teach her to touch the paper. Um, same thing when we say ah. Uh, paper we want her to touch the scissors that took me a second yes good girl so we're gonna teach her that uh, when we say paper yes she touches the scissors and she wins and when we say rock she touches the paper and she wins so and then you can start to mix up where you put them you can add in out actual rock but that we won't get that far today so I will show you at the end how far we get. Okay, so she's learning pretty well how to discriminate between the two objects, our rock and our paper. Um, and so what I'm doing, I just wanna show you if I can, a quick video of exactly how it works. So I will probably start by tossing a reset cookie, get her attention back on me, rock. Yes. Oh, I want her paw on there. As long as her paw is on there, um, I'm going to continue feeding. I sort of just let her nibble the same treat, and you can always do this with her food so she doesn't uh, get too over-treated on that tiny little frame. But we want a constant stream of reinforcement while her paw is in contact with our <coughs> rock. And then we're going to toss our release cookie. Okay so that she's really learning to wait for a release before she stops a behavior and learning to wait and see what the command is. Rock. Yes. Mark yes right away when she gets it right. And um, then continual reinforcement while engaging in the command. Then, okay. So she's learning to wait for a release and wait to see what you want. If she starts offering it like that, toss the reset cookie and start over. Rock! Yes! That was a wonderful one, so I'm going to pay her very well because I don't know if you could see, but she used a lot of style and kind of smacked her paw down on it. Very good. She gets paid as long as she stays there, then okay. Okay, so her command for this object is paper. Yes, um, I'm not having her hold much duration. I'm just, okay, releasing right away, just because I don't know how comfortable that is to be stepping on this, but uh, you can play around with it. But the hand signal is like this, just the regular paper rock scissors. Toss your reset cookie. There she comes back. Paper! Yes! Good girl. Oh, oopsie. My bad. Okay. Paper! Yes! Good girl. Okay. Ready? Paper! Yes! Did you see she looked at both of them and waited to see what signal I was going to give her? And reset cookie. Okay. Comes back. Trick her. Rock. Yes. Good girl. Okay, so she's only going to get more proficient, but she's doing really well. Okay. Yes. You won. Rock. You won again. 